Let's make a smoked beef wellington surf and turf. We're going to use a six to eight ounce filet with salt, pepper, and olive oil. Generously apply the salt and pepper. And add the olive oil to a skillet and bring up to searing temperature. We're going to add the filet and be sure to sear at the top and bottom. Cooking about one minute aside and be sure to get all the edges as well to form that magnificent crust. Let it rest and then put in the refrigerator for at least 20 minutes to cool down. Lay out enough plastic wrap to fit a thawed piece of puff pastry and layer on some prosciutto. I'm replacing the traditional duxelle with Petrosian La Truffe truffle infused mushroom sauce. Remove the now chilled filet from the refrigerator and place just below the center line of the puff pastry. Use the plastic wrap to help you roll the wellington. Be sure to keep it a tight roll and a clean seam without overlapping the pastry. Trim off the excess pastry on the left and right side. Now seal up the plastic wrap and begin tightly twisting the edges. Twist it very tightly over and over as this will help seal the wellington and create a uniform size for even cooking. Refrigerate the wellington for at least 30 minutes up to a day. Remove the wellington from the refrigerator and unwrap and apply an egg wash all over. With the spine of a sharp knife, make a fun little pattern on the top side of the wellington. I'm going to smoke the wellington on my Rectech at 425 for at least 30 minutes. Once the wellington is finished cooking, be sure to rest it for a minimum of 10 minutes. In that time, go ahead and prepare your scallops. Liberally season the scallops with salt and pepper. Add two tablespoons of butter to a hot pan and sear the scallops. Cook the scallops about three minutes aside. Now that the wellington has rested, it can be sliced and served with some seared scallops topped with delicious Petrosian caviar and a red wine reduction sauce. Thank you for watching. Please leave a comment and let me know what you think.